Well, it's fantastic to be here for this great celebratory opening. It's been open for a little while for the local community, but this event today brings everybody together and recognises just how much work has taken place to get it all done. It's been a five and a half million pound project, funded through central government, but delivered locally. So a good bit of partnership working. So it's thanking people and, and bringing people together. In the case of a bridge, of course, literally. Work started on planning for the project almost days after the bridge collapsed, just after Boxing Day in 2015. Earlier this has been a very challenging project because it's a listed bridge, people wanted to retain the, the original appearance of it, but at the same time the bridge carried a huge number of different utilities from gas and water to the data cables. One of the problems was that uh, canal bridges are not really designed for flowing water, but seeing what's happened here, this, this bridge has now been designed to be really robust. Obviously we hope we would never see flooding on the scale that we did on Boxing Day, but this bridge has now been designed so it would cope with that flow and pressure of water if the worst happened again. We've rebuilt the bridge with a, with a concrete arch so it will be much stronger, much more resilient to any future flood impacts or anything else. So it's a, a heritage bridge with the look and feel of a heritage bridge, but it's also now a modern bridge that will withstand any future impact.